Right now, it's not uh, so well known um, what are the most important uh, T cells to use for manufacturing CAR T cells, as well as uh, what are really uh, the most beneficial phenotypes of CAR T cells uh, in a product. Uh, we have uh, quite a bit of evidence um, which is uh, correlative on a like per a patient level, uh, but we don't know as much on a per uh, T cell clone level. And of course, um, T cells uh, before infusion that are used for CAR T cell manufacturing, they are very diverse. And uh, CAR T cells in the infusion product that are used for infusion, there's also quite a bit of diversity. Uh, so even though um, the patient would respond well or progress, we still don't know uh, which individual CAR T cell clones were really uh, most associated with that. Uh, so our study here um, broadens understanding of CAR T cell biology by looking at the clonal level, what were the features of those most clinically relevant um, T cell clones. It's really um, solid tumor uh, biology in terms of um, uh, in terms of translating CAR T cells uh, into making a difference for all uh, um, all patients with cancer. Uh, in this uh, meeting, there were a few presentations that really highlight the uh, recent successes uh, with patients uh, having complete response uh, in some cases. Uh, for example, in our GD2 CAR trial uh, in kids with uh, brain cancer, and there are a few others. Uh, and it's um, really exciting to really learn things that uh, work best uh, in cases where CAR T cells work well uh, to make um, CAR T cells work really well for all patients with cancer.